On 21st February, Chip joined Nvidia's stock after a brief rebound, nosedive straight to hell again. In just six days, $300 billion vanished from its market cap. All thanks to DeepSeek, the Chinese AI superstar that nobody knew a month ago. When DeepSeek announced its open source week, investors around the world knew Nvidia was about to face another round of nuclear strikes. And surprisingly, DeepSeek has released a revolutionary technology that is going to blow up one of Nvidia's seemingly impenetrable moats in AI training. And most devastatingly, it is free. For years, Nvidia CEO Jensen Huang has convinced the entire industry that building smarter AI requires ever-increasing compute, and each new generation of Nvidia GPUs dwarfs the previous one. This creates a vicious cycle. AI companies are compelled to empty their wallets, upgrading hardware all the time, or run the risk of being left behind. The forced obsolescence strategy fueled Nvidia's meteoric rise to three trillion valuation. Now, DeepSeek may change the game entirely. Most AI firms use two types of NVIDIA chips, the budget H800 and the premium H100, which is twice as powerful, but $10,000 pricier per unit. But DeepSeek's new flash MLA technology works like magic. It turbocharges the outdated H800 to handle long text processing 10 times faster, while even outperforming the H100 chips in reasoning tasks by two times. And here's the kicker. Flash MLA doesn't need new hardware. It's like unlocking hidden superpowers in existing GPUs. Imagine compute as water. Traditional algorithms are like bumbling bucket brigades lugging fixed capacity buckets. Want a sip? Wait for the whole bucket to be filled first. And worse, some thirsty fool filling a teacup hogs the line, leaving the guy with an empty Olympic pool tapping his foot in the dust. You see, tons of resources are wasted on tiny tasks, and those simple requests clock all the bandwidth while complex jobs wait forever. Flash MLA, though, it's this smart valve that makes our bucket boys look prehistoric. It breaks down your text into chunks, dynamically allocating compute based on complexity. A stained dribble for simple sentences, while brain-busting logic will get a firehose blast. These Precision watering system helps to squeeze every drop from lower-end GPUs and speeds up workflows dramatically. In a fallout, two existential threats to NVIDIA. First, AI firms will stop their GPU shopping spree since there's no need hoarding chips blindly. Reuters reported on the 25th that Microsoft already started axing data center leases. Even utility companies powering these centers saw stock prices tank. Second, Nobody's buying NVIDIA's incremental upgrades anymore. We call them toothpaste innovation here. Every time you squeeze out a tiny dab, they're not biting it. Unless Huang can roll out a chip 10 times juicier performance-wise, but good luck with that, because it's physically impossible under the curse of Moore's law. Meanwhile, NVIDIA's consumer GPUs are becoming a meme. Their flagship RTX 5000 series keep failing spectacularly melting power cables, random black screen bugs, missing hardware features. And since February, Nvidia's official driver updates haven't fixed anything. On their tech forum, a user found a genius solution. Cap your screen refresh rate at 60 Hz. What a joke! Imagine buying a Lamborghini only to be told don't drive over 50 miles per hour, or the engine might explode. This has left many early adopters fuming over their premium purchases. If such problems are left unaddressed by NVIDIA, folks will lose their appetite for its overhyped new toys. And here's the irony. While the world's AI companies were guzzling bucket water from the only supplier in town, NVIDIA's fortress looked indeed impenetrable. That's why the US government tried to cripple China's AI development by blocking H100 sales. Little did they expect this little embargo could backfire so spectacularly, forcing Chinese startups like DeepSeek to squeeze every drop of performance from older chips, ultimately undermining Nvidia's entire business model. Talk about poetic justice. And this is just a starter in DeepSeek's open source week. More disruptive technologies are coming, and let's see how many wars of America's AI fortress can survive the siege.